situation is here at the sanctuary, we've got a juvenile raccoon that's got some kind of trash stuck on its head. It's up in the tree above our snow leopard cages because, you know, nothing can be easy here. So it looks like it's a, a jar um, or a plastic container. So we're going to try to get the raccoon safely down, remove the trash from its head, keep our snow leopards safe, and keep all the volunteers safe. So nobody gets bitten, the raccoon gets freed, and snow leopards don't get a free lunch or free snack. So um, it's up there pretty high. We're going to see what happens. <laughs> So, this raccoon is not very happy, but at least he doesn't have that plastic container on his head, and he didn't get eaten by a snow leopard. So, we're going to go find a safe place to let him go. One of the crazy things about raccoons is, even though they're very cute, they're actually very mean, and they do carry rabies. They don't make any better of a pet than one of the big cats. They are still very much wild animals. So it's one of those real simple things. This was a, a plastic container for creamy peanut butter and someone just casually tossed it aside or allowed the raccoons to get into their garbage can. Somehow he got his head wedged in here and he definitely would have died if he wouldn't have found his way here to Big Cat Rescue. So another reason not to litter and to keep your trash secure, then you won't have raccoons around your house anyways. But job well done and little rascally raccoon is back out safe. Hopefully he'll uh, stay away from plastic these days.